Hello and welcome back to Tesla News. My name is Marion and I'm your host today and I'm going to give you a new update regarding the battery pack, the 4680 cells and why you shouldn't wait to buy this car with this battery pack. And there are different reasons for that. And of course, as well, a different reason by location. And we will look into that right now. So first of all, we have the Tesla SEMA, which is one of the reasons why you shouldn't wait for the new battery pack. And of course, we have the so waited for Cybertruck. So these are two products which will consume a lot of the production capacity of the 4680 cells by next year. And of course, Tesla won't be delaying the Cybertruck another time. They just cannot do that because um, Rivian is out there and Ford is out there. I'm not saying that those two products are better, but I'm just saying um, just for customer satisfaction, it is better to move forward and start production. Another reason is as well the Model Y performance. So here it's getting interesting. In Germany, in Europe, we thought the Model Y performance is going to receive the new battery pack. Since Austin started though with the Model Y standard range and um, getting the new battery pack into that car, there's a lot of questions for people in the United States though. If you don't want to wait for Model Y standard range, you should really just buy the car you like and then wait until the ramp up is happening. And in Germany, we are still a bit more far away from the ramp up because we are still building the battery factory. And so if you consider that aspect, you still have to build the battery factory, which is on plan. It's the way it's supposed to be. And then you'll just have the performance variant. But for the European market, as a European customers, you don't even know is Tesla going to copy the strategy like in Austin, building a standard range? Are you buying now a Model Y performance waiting for the new battery pack, but it's not even going into the new uh, Model Y performance? It's rather going into the standard range, which maybe Tesla is launching next year. Who knows? So for the European customers, a lot of questions. So I would just advise buy a car, wait a year, a year and a half till the ramp up is working very well. And then you buy another Tesla. You just resell your Tesla that you just bought if you really want to have have this new battery pack. And for the people from the United States, on the other hand, it will take a lot of time until all those cars in a standard range um, mode are actually successfully delivered to customers. So if you are not interested in a standard range, um, don't wait until it gets to the long range or the performance variant, because it will take a lot of time. And of course, you have the two products I just mentioned, the Semi and the Cybertruck. So I don't believe Tesla is going to roll out 4680 salts on performance, long range and standard range Model Y and then Cybertruck and Sema. That's not going to happen. So if you are not saying, oh, I want a standard range, I'm going to wait for that car from Austin. That would be the only reason because you're so close to getting the new battery pack. But for anybody else out there, don't wait just buy a Tesla because it's going to take a lot of time, guys. I don't mind that in a negative way, but we have seen how many challenges Tesla has. And of course, the production ramp. I mean, a million sales are just for like two and a half thousand, three thousand cars. So they really need to ramp up the production. And this is going to take some time. And if you even if you have enough battery cells, you have so many products waiting for it. Cybertruck, Semi and Standard Range Model Y. So many, many reasons not to wait um, for a battery pack with the 4680 cells um, if you are wanting a car soon. So that is the main case here. If you don't want to wait for ages, you have to just buy what is happening right now. And for European customers, it's the same for the United States customer. You just take the car right now, you receive it, you resell it, the market is there. And at some point when the battery packs are continuously going into cars, the new ones, then you can decide to buy another one, even though it's not maybe not the most sustainable way, but it's the only way not to wait for ages. So please let me know if you agree with me. Um, if you have comments to that statement, um, let me know down in the comment section and I wish you a wonderful day. Take care. Thank you.